Well, the Montana extreme heat doesn't just affect humans. It affects the animals here at the last chance stampede as well. I'm going to take a deep dive into how these animals are cared for during temperatures that exceed 100 degrees. It is very hard to care for livestock in general, but when adding extreme weather to the mix, the 4-H members participating in this year's events at the last chance stampede must consider new challenges. In addition to having fans present around the halls and barns, plenty of care and attention need to be given to animals during peak heating hours. Sarah Deering, a member of the 4-H club, spoke to me about how she cares for her black Angus cow named Muzzle. I'm making sure their water is always clean, making sure it's cool, and making sure that they are washed up most times that they are getting hot. Other individuals I spoke with added that they altered the feeding times of their cattle to cooler parts of the day, like early in the morning or late at night, to reduce overall stress and improve health by limiting their caloric intake. I even got a first-hand account from a willing participant in this year's 4-H market sheep show to see how heat affects him personally. All right, well, how do you feel about the extreme heat? Ah. Insightful, thank you. But it's not just the animals this heat will affect. Montanans all over the state will be dealing with triple digit temperatures to end the work week. If you're heading out to the last chance stampede, be sure to take advantage of the air conditioning in the exhibit and entry halls. Attendees will be permitted to bring their own water onto the grounds to stay hydrated. Reporting in Helena, meteorologist Joey Bianconi, MTN News.